First round of the Charles Schwab Challenge. Patrick Reed and PGA Tour Live's morning featured group coverage on Thursday. This was a 12 from 164 yards. And watch it disappear for an eagle. That got Reed to minus three in a hurry. Jordan Speed, also part of featured group coverage. Second hole, 82 yards away, zipping one in there. That led to a birdie. It got Speed to minus four. Phil Mickelson only had a couple of birdies. Looked a little sluggish, as you might expect, and poured that one in, much to the delight of the big gallery there at the nine. Speed at seven. His second nine. That would uh, kick off a string of three straight birdies, including this one at the eighth, in a manner in which only a few in the game can do it. The scrambling was superb. One of the best in the field in strokes gained around the greens and on the greens Thursday, despite missing six greens in regulation. But he didn't miss this one at the ninth, his final hole of the day. That was saucy. 31 coming in for speed. He signed for 63, trying to win here for the second time. Billy Horschel for birdie at the eighth. He had a weird day. Shot 31 on the front with five birdies, but then five bogeys on the back for 40 coming in. Sergio Garcia, the champion here 20 years ago. The putter was pretty cooperative on Thursday. That could be a good sign for the Spaniard going forward this week. Putter is always cooperative for Kevin Kisner, isn't it? Pop this one in for birdie at the nine. Kis, another one of the past champions in the field. Shot 32 in his opening nine. Garcia for another birdie here from long range at the 10th. And this would move him to minus four. Sergio, sixth best in the field in the opening round in strokes gained on the greens. And one of the game's finest bunker players over the last two decades and evidence of it here at 11. In there for an eagle at the par five. And Garcia was threatening Spieth's lead, closing in on it with shots like this one into the 15th. Tight hole location, but he fit one in there from 104 yards away, and he would grab a share of the lead at seven under. Justin Thomas here at 15, taking care of business, dropped a few shots through the middle of the round and got it around in a couple over to start the week. And Jason Kokrak, already a winner this season, the CJ Cup out in Las Vegas last fall, looking to win for a second time. Long birdie here at 17 to shoot 65, and he's two off the lead.